it's any consolation, I like the jacket. You know what, I appreciate that. Be successful, yep, look successful. So I always said. Well, were you? Yes, that's why I'm here cleaning with you instead of in the bedroom with Karen. Karen, Karen. Which one's Karen? The hot one. Oh. Success. You were successful in getting it everywhere. <sighs> Don't worry about it, we'll mop it up later. Everything's sticky anyway. Shit, I'm sticky. You know, it's still, we had a good housewarming party. I had fun. Your housewarming party, I already lived here. Well, then you should have thrown one for me, shouldn't you? Spill update, it's going under the cabinet. Don't worry, I got it. I uh, was perfectly content watching my shows and eating my mac and cheese, but uh, here I am cleaning up after your housewarming party. Hey, you know what? Your friends came too. So, I mean, that's important, right? You had fun. Yeah, all two of them who were already coming here to eat said mac and cheese and watch said shows. You know what? Like I said, your friends came. You opened up your social circle a little bit. You met some people. I mean, I don't understand the big deal. You know, I've only been here about a week, but I think I'm really starting to dig it. Not to mention, I already furnished the place. Yeah, that too. Jeez. What is this, rock candy? Did you know that rock candy is made from a super saturated sugar solution? The sugar concentration is so great, it nucleates in whatever you put in there. It's self-propagating too, hence the crystalline shape. I did not know that, no. Oh, jeez. Oh, smells like cat piss. Come here, come here. It smells like crystal meth. Who the hell is that? Crystal meth. Put it back. Wait, no, no, no. How, how do you know this? What is this? I, you know what? Forget it. I'm... How do you know that? Why is this here? Why are you whispering? of it's not gonna force you to smoke it. And to answer your other questions, it's the most logical answer, and I don't know. So what do we do with it? Flush it, who cares? We can't flush it, it'll taint the water supply. Yes, I would sure hate to get all those people high that drink sewer water when our meth mixes with the millions of gallons of water at the treatment plant. Oh, shut up, we, we, sh we should call the cops, is what we should do. Why? They'll probably implicate you, question everyone you know. Cops make things more complicated. <sighs> so then what? What I would be more concerned with is if the person who owns the drugs comes back for them. Shit. Who do you think brought it here? What if they come back for it and it's not under the cabinet? What if they bring a gun? Remember when I told you I had two friends? It wasn't them. Thanks. Thanks for the help, Jeb. Thanks a lot. So what are we going to do? Well, Matt, first of all, are you sure you didn't smoke any? You seem pretty uh, paranoid all of a sudden. Yeah, I'm, I'm really high right now. No, what, 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 what did they come back for their drugs? Give them their drugs. But I saw them. Here's some of that drugs. I could go for some pot right now if you guys have it. Lenny. This carpet is disgusting. So Matt, Matt's roommate? Yo. Um. What are you guys still doing here? And in my bedroom? Well, uh, my place is being fumigated right now. This is the guy that whined to me about still living with his parents. Yes, that too. Thank you for bringing that up. Okay. Well, Karen is here and uh, we just borrowed your room. Should have uh, wore your bed sheets. You would have had uh, more luck. Shut up, Jeb. Look, wait, it's fine. Well, it's not really fine. That's it, not important right now. We have really other things to deal with at the moment. Like steam cleaning your carpet? Solid plan. When are you going to go pick it up? What? Carpet. I'm pretty sure it's something about drugs and there being a lot of them. <laughs> drugs? Drugs. Drugs here? Drugs? No. No, there's no drugs here. Not at all. No. And, and, and if there happened to be drugs at all, anywhere, um, I wouldn't know where they were or who had them or at all. Right, Jeb? No, Matt found a big bag of crystal meth under the cabinet. What? Shut up, Jeb. Crystal meth. Let me see it. 
whip it out. Whose is it? There must be like five pounds here. I appreciate everyone has their fingerprints on the bag now, except for me. Uh, I'm not much of a sports guy. How much do you think it's worth? Four hundred to three thousand dollars per ounce, depending on the region. Now, this is a heroin area, so uh, it's more likely to be on the higher end of the scale. Well, well, thanks, Mr. Scientist. You did your research. Why do you know that? So, are you guys gonna sell it? Sell it? Are you nuts? I don't. I don't want, I want anything to do with it. I don't even want it here. Well, shit. I'll find something to do with it. Uh, no, you won't. What if whomever it is comes back for it? Then what? What am I gonna say? Oh, I just gave it to Lenny. Oh, you boom, just. I'm dead. No, it's not the thing right here. You just said you didn't want it here. I do, but that's not the point. You should try it. Uh, no, we should not. Well, come on, live a little. This is probably the only time we're gonna see Matt. When they come back for it, they're not gonna notice that a bit's missing. They'll probably notice all of it missing once you start taking it to feed your growing addiction. Addicted? This is just a test run. Live a little, or at all. Level headed through life is all I could ask for. Boring. Just a tiny taste, a sampling. No way. You want to end up on faces of meth or something like that? You're too pretty for that. Oh, you think I'm pretty? Of course I do. That's why I invited you here. I had no idea. I kind of started rolling on Molly the second I walked in here, so I'm not really picking up on subtleties. Yeah, sorry, bro. Me neither. I mean, maybe if you talk to her during the party or something. I was trying to be a good host, you know, and I was trying to have a good time, but all the time I spent talking to you at work? Oh well, yeah, we're work friends. And I came to your housewarming party. <sighs> I think we're losing sight of what's really going on right now. I think we need to really focus on what's important at the moment. Here's the best course of action. Put the drugs back in the cabinet exactly where you found them. That way, so when people are over, they'll have ample access to the drugs in the kitchen without you in it. That's stupid. Uh, no, no, I think he's right. If we should hear him out. That makes sense. Put it back under and pretend we never saw it and go on with our lives. There's like $50,000 worth of drugs here. Maybe more. That's life-changing. Or life-starting. You literally just had sex with Lenny. You're still wearing his shirt and no pants and high heels. Yeah, where's the loyalty? Loyalty? We met like two hours ago. Who cares what I've done? It's what I'm doing now, which is being pragmatic. A couple minutes ago, you wanted to try it. I still do. Take some, sell the rest, and we run away together. Me and you? This the ecstasy we're talking? No, idiot. Me and her. This isn't friend zone. Nobody is running away with the crystal meth or Karen or anyone, okay? If anyone finds anything, it'll be me, okay? And, and I found both of them, okay? Just that's why I make that clear. I don't appreciate being objectified. I already had to get myself off, so maybe I'll run away with the drugs by myself. What happens to a lot of guys? Nothing like that happened. I think she wants to be just friends with your genitalia. Shut up, look, I think we all saw this. We need to do something about it, okay? Look, we'll split it into thirds, Lenny. You can sell your third. Karen, you can smoke your part of the meth. And Matt, you can put your portion back under the cabinet. That way you can have it on hand when Karen offers to have sex with you. Hey! So that's the most likely outcome. You don't want your own chair? Well, if I have to, I'll put my stash of the meth under the sink with Matt. <laughs> you honestly don't think they would notice half of their stash gone? They definitely would notice. What are you doing? Just seeing if there's something else. Okay, guys, I think to be safe, we should all put the meth back and agree to never speak about it again, okay? Speak about what? God, you're weird. Hey, I found something. Guess they stashed this, too. Jesus Christ, are you fucking kidding me? Nope. 
You too. You're with me. Um, no thanks. What do you mean, no? We've only known each other for a few hours, and you weren't able to get off, and I have a problem, apparently. So, no. What about this? No, not interested. So nobody here wants to watch me smoke some meth and then fuck me while high? No. 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 Well, maybe you're just gonna have to come anyway. Oh, I get it. Shut up. Okay. Okay, you so, don't even like him? 